Good evening, everybody. This is David Slash Asher, and joining me tonight is, well, MPX. Nobody else. Yes. Nobody wants to be associated with this game. Well, I think half the people don't even know about this game, and the <laughs> other half uh, honestly would have just as much difficulty commenting about this game. So, we're going to see how... Uh, we're going to try and finish this. There shouldn't be too much left, honestly. But... There could be more stuff. So, let's get this down. And why are you not capturing it this time? Are you not... Okay. Okay. I am seeing a picture. Eh. Oh, that's what's going on. Yeah. Okay, there it goes. So, there we... Uh, okay, so we... We beat Pazuzu. We... We actually have to go... We have defeated the Exorcist Part 2. Trying to remember if it's like, do I have to go back to? Feels like we'd have to go back to the top of the tower. Not sure if I have to call the elevator or just go back to. I think did, I think I did the top of the tower, so now it's just talking to Otto here. We still have Captain Mac to worry about. Princess just said you'd help. Oh hey, B Ruben, are you okay? Yeah, guess what I found when I fell. Stairway to the top of the Focus Tower! Stairway? I've got it! If we refill the dry lake, we can save Captain Mac! Uh, how? Go to Spencer's Tunnel. Set a bomb there, and the water from the upper lake will spill into the dry lake. But Spencer's Tunnel's caved in. There's one way! You power the Rainbow Road Machine with Thunder Rock! Can reach Spencer's place. Dad will know about this. Kaylee, would you take care of Norma? Ruben and I know the Focus Tower well. We'll be back from Fireburg in no time. Of course. Ruben joined. back to the end just to heal up. Also, I did some checks as to what each item does. Mm -hmm. Refreshers are uh, the things that do like defense down or attack down. They don't and so it's like, I thought there was a revive item. The difference between debuffs and, you know, CC. Yeah.
Was it just me or was uh, Kaylee actually higher level than Ruben? So I thought she was 32. Oh, well, wow. could probably fill up on a few things. One of which is this. Okay. Got 35 seats. So, 15. This could be one of those, like, argh moments of, like, how could you forget all this stuff? I'm... <laughs> oh, he's right here. Spencer, the Tony Junkies came in! And Phoebe is looking for you! Oh, well, I guess I'll head back to Aquaria. Let's see you again, kid. Okay, where the fuck is Ruben's dad now? I guess we have... search this area. Yeah, kinda. We're doing something a bit different. Hmm. Different music. Oh, look. We're in Aquaria. Get out of the way.
Maybe I'm supposed to actually go into the tunnels? Supposed to go there. Okay, brief check. Yes? Okay, supposedly Ruben's father is some... Okay... Well, we're going back to Fireburg. Yeah, it shows is very lackluster. It's like, talk to Rube instead. Where? Other than Fireberg? Trying a different walkthrough this time. Oh, I've been going to the wrong house. Ah.
And he's right there. In bed. In bed. Aaron, have you heard the rag? Oh wait, Aaron, have you ever heard? Of course. Wait a second. Here, take it. Where was that kept? <laughs> Why do you have it? I'm not gonna bother with most chests. They have brown boxes now because it's like they're not worth it. <laughs> Technically, the only ones really worth it are ammo refills and seed ones, which I think there's only like three of the seed ones in the entire game. The rest all just do like potions, uh, heals, or refreshes, or our ammo. might be useful if you were doing a speed run of some sort, but even that. Yeah. Can't use that one. some thunder rock, eh? Thunder! Thunder! Thunder rock! Pose! Pow complete! Now you can go to Spencer's place! Ruben, keep your eyes on Bro Bridge and say hello to Arian. What did you do up here? <laughs> the gears are no longer moving. Oh, wait. Wrong way. Oh, look! Another bridge! Let's blow that area up with a bank grenade! <laughs> it's just out of nowhere, toss the grenade! Kaylee. No, I want to get the stuff that might be around here. Okay. Because we now have the Mobius Crest. That's going to be helpful for a good few things, and we needed that anyway.
past year, the wreck is beautiful as ever. It worked. The ship is afloat. Thanks. I'll head there now. The ship's full of monsters. Let's go first. Give this captain cap to Dad when you find him. Then he'll know I'm coming. Receive the captain cap. Sad to say. <laughs> So, we've now got every single item in the game. There are only three crests, Libra, Gemini, or Mobius, which I think that's more of like Omega something and Mobius. The Thunder Rock. The various coins. Uh, so, uh, we are only missing two items in our gear, which those ones will be a long while. Okay, and so now we need to go find the person with the downstairs here, which I think that's this house. It's great when the wind calm is calm like this. Get out of the way, child! Because we need the Mobius Crest. Not where I was hoping to go. Chris is buried in Spencer's place. If we had it, we could reach the ship dock from here. Ship dock. <laughs> Princess right there. That one pulled up. Okay. Ruben, sleeping on the job. I think I was not supposed to do that. <laughs>
Oh wow, he actually has white. As for why I'm kind of just bum-rushing to the end, there are no special items in Max Ship. They're all brown chests. They... There's no need to do it. Okay, so I technically did find a workaround, it's just... Have to go all the way around... I'm slowly working my way to where I need to be. As usual. Yeah. So while we're trying to get through this, uh, let's discuss what we're going to do for next uh, game for the stream. Yes. Did you finally decide? Uh, it's kind of a toss-up, really, because I like the idea of because this was a common one of like, hey, why don't you do a uh, like in addition to Eddie doing. Sandland, which, yes, he is planning on doing Sandland. It's just after the whole Elden Ring thing. But somebody suggested, like, why don't you try one of the other uh, games done by Akira Toriyama? Things ranging from Chrono Trigger to one of the Dragon Quest games. To, quite literally, it's like, hey, what about Blue Dragon, the forgotten one? Um... To some uh, suggestions of like 
somebody suggested, like, why don't you do the new Trials of Mana? But you do it with these specific characters. Uh, and I don't think I've gotten your input yet on this, MPX. Uh, well, we already did Chrono Trigger, I thought. But did we? I don't I, think I we know. did. I don't think we did. I think we might have started it. Oh. Oh, I don't know. It probably was before my time, either way. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I think most people have done Chrono Trigger to death, so. Yeah. I would probably go for one of the Dragon Quests. Like, I think a fair amount of them are now actually translated, so... Yeah. Uh, so... No longer have that impenetrable boundary of, like, oh, trying to find Dragon Warrior ROMs or something. Good god, no. I mean, the uh, the one... Uh, people suggested if I was going to do Dragon Quest, either do, like, eight or eleven. Which, I do have 11, Definitive Edition. And I did actually have played a little bit of it, so... Um... Let's see. I mean, I am super familiar with Corona Sugar. And while I would absolutely love to do uh, Blue Dragon, uh, it has the limitation of quite literally, it's like I'd have to drag my 360. Or, and I do mean or. Uh, get a modern Xbox console and basically stream, uh, I'll, uh, set up the whole, like, play off your Xbox on Windows and record that. Well, I know there's rumors about, uh, the new PlayStation, which is just, you know, PlayStation 5 Pro. Yeah. I don't know if there's a Xbox Pro. As of right now, the only ones that I could think of are basically just getting an Xbox Series X. That's it. Um... Down. Okay, I think I see what I have to do. Uh, admittedly, the PlayStation one is going to, it's like, I'm, that one may take a bit of time. God damn it, Ruben.
I mean, there, uh, there is another possibility, which I'm not sure I like that. All oh, right, these guys are wind weak. And that's attempting now, uh, attempting. Attempting. Uh, 360 emulation, which. But, eh, to, eh, eh, to me, like, doing a eh, 360 emulation just... Really? Seems like a bit of a hassle, or...? Seems kind of like... Really? Do I... Like, that seems like too much work. When I have easier options available to me. figure out how to deal with this. Okay, that is the computer cheating, because of... guys are weak against. Definitely not Blizzard. Quake? Is it fire?
double checking. Okay, there is a... I'm dumb. And apparently there is actually a important piece of uh, equipment here. It's just, it's on the way. Oh good, 32. Soon, one of these days we'll actually one-shot these guys. <laughs> And we got Gaia's armor, which is the important one. Which means now we are strong against water, wind, poison, and sleep. Which means we are missing one thing. Also, who's this old man here? Is is that my captain hat? Kaylee asked to give it to you. Are you okay? Blonk. Dad, I was worried about you. You look awful. I'm okay, but I've had some bad news. I had a bad chimera. Didn't cook right. The, the Dark King. Prophecy. Also, your dad has the burblies in his dummy. Dad, tell us about the prophecy later. Well, let's kill your wounds in Windia first. Boy. Nope. <laughs> I'm okay. I, I guess I haven't recovered from that fall off the bridge. Ruben, let's go to Windy and put you to bed. But dirt, dirt, dirt. It's. Spencer and Tristan. There you are! Spencer, Phoebe's been looking for you. I met her at the end of India, and now she wants to see you. 
We're done here. Let's go. Right. See you again, kid. we have to go to the inn. As Ruben slowly collapses because he's been walking on broken shins. Oh, hey, look, Phoebe. Ruben's hurt. My shin bones. I'm good. I'm surprised you made it. It was such a bad wound. Off to bed with you. Goodbye, Ruben. You were useless. But you need to hear Max news. You're not gonna like it. And we get Phoebe, who I think is going to be our penultimate partner. Uh, I don't think there's going to be any more changes past this point, probably. No, I, there is one person after Phoebe, and I know, and it's Tristan. Either that, or... Dad will return to Foresta when he's feeling better. It, what can be so important? You already discovered the last part of the prophecy. The one behind the four is darker than the night and rises, Mr. Land. You have saved the crystals, but our real enemy is the Dark King. He's in the Focus Tower. Reach the tower with my ship. Stand by the steering wheel and press the A button. Trust me. My steering wheel has an A button on it. Didn't know they made ancient sailing ships with a giant huge A button. But here we are. Final Fantasy airship. Of course it has an A button on it. But it's a sailing ship. It's not an airship. That's probably the one downside, is that this is probably the only Final Fantasy without an airship. Can't get it. Oh, hey, that changed to arrows instead of bombs. So, because we saved Mac, it's no longer Misty, and... Technically, we can now raid the entire thing with chests if we really wanted to. And this is all it really does is just... it. It's a route that brings us to that. Alright, let me get that map up. Wait, what? No. Oh, hey, we got people in here. Kevin May. Fuck it, I'm just gonna stock up on seeds. And we now have, I think, Max. The only thing we're missing is refreshers, but we don't care about that. Focus Tower. Hey, we've seen this part before. Okay. So, figure out where that is. Let's see. 
But now, yeah, now we're fighting things like these, uh, shadows here. Bow of Grace. with spork. Oh no, he duplicated. guy looks kind of familiar. Zombie Minotaur. Weak against shoot. Damn it, the ninja multiplied itself. did this weirdly. So, this area, basically, as you can see, the sands is kind of like, oh, constantly going down.
Huh. Oh wait, no. That was C. That was... I'm looking for... Oh, T is that way. Okay. And the Aegis Shield. We now have officially everything. And the Aegis is really nice in the fact that A, it prevents being stoned. So, heck yes. Sorry, I forgot I was muted. <laughs> it's fine. So, no more instant death scenarios. At this point, our hero Bob is nigh invincible to status effects. Uh, to my knowledge, there is no anti-instant death, because that is a... Is there even instant death in this game? Yes, there is. Uh, but my understanding, instant death is much more of, like, oh, hey. Well, let's go confront. Hey, they did reuse this boss right. Kinda. Skullrus Rex. Oh no. Self just <laughs> oh. Doom Dance. That's one of the instant death attacks that I've seen. Stone gas. See how much flare does. Much better. <laughs> Hmm. 
Admittedly, he's a lot weaker than his counterpart. Well, you're also a different level one. You have better stuff. Oh, look, we're in basement one of Focus Tower. Apparently, Focus Tower has been the final dungeon this entire f fucking we time. Don't say. <laughs> it opened. Doom Castle! Fourth floor. Oh boy. Puppy? Care Bruce. Doom Gaze, that's another instant death attack. Okay. That is the way to get back. So weird and wrong. Time to go fix it. Great. All I can think of because of that is like, oh, great. Thank you.
got a feeling that I'm probably gonna have to, uh, go this way because. I probably have to get the door open for the boss, and this is the way forward. At this point, because I have, like, 99 seeds, and they give me all my magic bags, might as well be using most powerful spells to get through this fucking dungeon. God damn it, the ninjas! Fuck you, meteor! <laughs> you get meteored! Is he just... I, I just noticed this, but is he just flexing his pecs? Uh, that, that, that's supposed to be reflections. Okay, strike first! Stone Golem spell. Thunder. Fire. Strong. White. Blizzard. Confusion. Okay, white is decent. Meteor? Yee! <laughs> I like how he's a stone golem, but he's also melting. 
So obviously this guy is probably weak against Arrow. You okay? Sorry, everybody. Uh, just a bit of a weird hiccup on my part. White was the only thing that did decent damage to him. That is an instant death spell, apparently. The corrode attack. because we've defeated this one. It now opens up this next level, and this is how the tower works. Okay, I think those are grapple points. Check over here briefly. Yep. Huh. <sighs> Oh, he's green now. So, let's see here. Okay, I see what I have to do.
death to puppers! Since I know these guys are actually weak to a fire spell. That's the way back, which means we have to go this way. That would be a bit cursed. Replacing the sprite of Steno in here with the, um... The copy of what Steno looks like in FGO. Eh. I mean, crunched up to SNES levels, but yeah. Weak against thunder. Thunder's probably going to be a go better for Bob. Thank you. 
now we only have pretty much one floor left. Alright, I'll just go this way. And then beat up this poet. Poor boy. Boys. Oh no! Okay, did not expect that, but it will probably not drop me in the lava. So. Okay. Gonna be one of those weird ones where I have to get on top. Zoob-zoob. Oh wait, no, this one doesn't matter. Okay. I got the layout now. So, first we have to get on top, then loop around, and then get on the bottom again to then go up to another top section. Thank you. 
Hey, 33. <laughs> And here we go. Oh no, quake. Well, time to see what uh, they replaced Pazuzu with. Zo. Not the zoo, the zo. Not even the zo, it's just uh zo. Zo attacks with hurricane. Pile driver. Oh, oh god. Doom dance. No, no, no. Please, no instant death right now. Uh, meteor. Here. Sky attack. Earth. Okay. Thunder. Nope. Oh, good. Psy shield.
Right, I forgot Psy Shield does that. Psy Shield down. Shoot. Garbage man. Side shield down. Critical hit. <laughs> no. I want to get off this crazy ride. Actually, I could just drop down to the next floor once I get down one level. And we have this giant huge room. Phoebe, Knights of Light, three crystals now entrust you with our power. So these chests are going to be very unique in the fact that they basically, I believe, give 25 of every item. So like Cure Potions, Heal Potions, Seeds, and... 
arrows. It seems underwhelming, honestly. Yeah. And, well, hmm, eyeballs. Speaking of Dragon Quest, <laughs> there's this green man here. Well, is he called the Mao? Dark, well, take me, well, he's called the Dark King, so. Dark King, which, uh, probably is the case. <laughs> Mao. Indeed. And now you will serve me! I don't think so. We won't allow you to ruin our world. Alas, silly humans, I must share a terrible secret. The prophecy? Ages ago I started that rumor. Welcome to the power of darkness! Rumor mongering? So, I think this guy... is definitively green. Jesus! <laughs> okay, I may have been wrong. Phoebe is our penultimate. Uh, is the our ultimate ultimate uh, side character? I thought we got Christian. Iron nail. That's down. Peristare, which obviously Bobby's going to be immune to. How amusing! Is that all you can muster? Hmm. No, he's not Greg enough. He, he can't pull off Greg. He's only got six arms, not eight. I've seen Greg with also, four. it's hard to use a bow with one hand. Yeah. <laughs> Dark Saber! Mirror sword. No, oh, I see is what I really am. Th th there's a thing called the Evil Overlord list, and this guy did. One of it went against the rules, which is never turn yourself into a giant spider. It never helps. It's either that or a giant snake. Maybe it's just turning yourself into a giant animal. Period. Yeah. Because, like, which animal would actually give you the strength to fight off the heroes? Make a white. Oh boy. Oh boy. Golden web. Petrify. actually don't care, but... You know what? Let's have Bob do care. Golden Web, who gets... And there goes Phoebe. Now 
Mega Flare. And now he's a tentacly spider. I mean, you weren't expecting that. There we go. Mega Flare. Dare you actually do that. Spider Kids! Oh no! We have defeated the Dark King and his Spider Kids! Yes! Yes! We defeated the Dark King! Who the fuck was he again? At last, it's all over. Second form? Nope. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Disguised as a human, I, the crystal of light, have guided you. Also, you're never getting that 10G back. Ha <laughs> ha! Evil can't thrive if you keep hope alive. Use your courage and respect your world. A bright future awaits you now. Go, enjoy all the world has to offer. Okay, go touch fucking grass, Bob. Th thank you? Didn't he that. touch grass enough <laughs> with his sword? That was his axe, and that was trees. <laughs> this... So this is all automatic. Bob, you're saying the Dark King was the problem and you beat him? Weird. Never heard of this Dark King before, but whatever. But of course. Say, what? Let's get Reuben and Cat Mac. Ah, they're fine. They've headed already home. Great. Sometime I'll drop by and say hi. Foresta. Kaylee's home. You're safe. What are you gonna do now? Hey, maybe you can answer that. Mac, how about lend me that ship? I need a little more adventure in my life. Don't worry, Kaylee. Alright, well, let me see if it's still sea lore there. Don't forget your cap again. Aquaria. Go, time to go see Spencer in his cave. Spencer, you still digging? Yep, all because of you guys. Fucking room messed everything up. Have you seen Tristam? That jerk, he's got treasure on Tina Can. Well, tell him I said hi. <laughs> and Tristam is actually part of the band, apparently. How's it going? Ruben, could be better. Well, why don't you hang out in this town? No way, I'm off for more adventure in Captain Max ship. At least let me see you off. Shit's better than new. Thanks, Mac. Three cheers for Captain Bob. Wait until you see my next adventure. Can you come over again? Have a good trip. Do it up while you're young. I think I've had all the adventure I can stand. I'm gonna join the rock band in my heavy armor. I think I'll call it Stone Rock or something. How about taking me along? You need an expert treasure hunter. No, Spencer. I think Phoebe's going to punch you in the face. 
Why don't you know what you're saying? You don't know what you're saying, Grandpa. You'll be back in no time. See the world for me. We're gonna miss you. Bye! I'm gonna miss you guys, too. Farewell! Thank God I'm out of here. Oh, wait! <laughs> Bye! And... Press A button. Some actually decent graphics. For once. That music can only mean one person. What what are you doing here? Can't resist when I hear about adventure. I'm gonna keep an eye on you, kid. That's Bob, you nut. And that's Mystic Quest. Wow, we actually finished fairly close to ending time. So, uh, yeah, this game is ten hours long if you do it right. Shorter if you're not like me and fudging around with stuff. Oh, look! Guess who's right there? <laughs> the most infamous man in translation slash localization. Mm -hmm. Ted Woosley. Most likely, the thing's like, Hey, can I borrow ten gil for a coffee? And... That's Bob, you nut. That is definitely Woosley. At the helm. Yeah, but it's... I would think that it's also... That they probably worked a bit more, considering this was specific for the NA. Yeah, well, it was imported over into Japan. Um... And as far as I know, it was poorly received by both audiences. Mm -hmm. uh, mostly because of the factor that A, the I believe North American release came out after Final Fantasy 4 came out. And so uh, people were like, oh hey, a new Final Fantasy. This is worse than four, and for people We're that have used, <laughs> and I'm using the uh, the actual uh, numbering because at the time it was known as Final Fantasy two. In uh, four was two for U.S. for quite a while, due to uh, various things. But as for what this, uh, what this game did, really nothing really out of the ordinary. I mean, like, it's stuff that we see both in games of the time and uh, current games. And I think I think this game just kind of sits there. I think they reused that for Chrono Trigger, the seagull cries. I mean, a lot of sound effects get reused. Wow, I just pressed a button, that's all it did. Mm -hmm. Um... But yeah, no, that's the end of the, uh, the game. Uh, as for everything that it did, uh, nothing new, actually. And as for what game we're doing next, I'm going to try and figure that out real quick. You have a week. I have a week. Um, outside of that, it's, like, the, re uh, the only reason why I did this is because, like, I was kind of, meh. Uh, would I recommend this game to anyone? No. Would I, if I had to force somebody to play this one, I would probably give it to my niece or nephew. 
And even then, they might be too old for it now. <laughs> I'd probably want them to play Final Fantasy 4, 5, or 6. <laughs> but... Is this kind of a, one of those things of like, but why'd you play it? It's like, because it's stupid, it's simple, and I knew it wasn't going to last. Th this is the fifth stream of it, right? Yes, I think so. Okay. So, I knew it was going to last long. Uh, which gives me a bit, of, a bit of more time to th sit down and think about stuff for the next game, which... Could be big, could be small. It also gives me time to address stuff like... Uh, I know Eddie talked about on Tuesday about potentially doing Helldivers 2 for multiplayer. I still think we can still maybe squeeze one or two streams of... Uh, Risk of Rain 2. Risk of Rain 2, thank you. Uh, before moving over to a different multiplayer game. Mm-hmm. Uh, on top of the current chicanery going on with Helldivers 2. Uh, as for the next stream, I will try and decide it and make sure it's good to go. Uh, whether I go down the route of, like, let's do a homage to Akira Toriyama, that's up for debate. Um, or if it's like, oh, let's do something completely different. Uh, I do have a lot of options available to me. I know some people are like, well, why don't you play a more modern game? Well, I technically can do modern games now with little to no hassle. I kind of want to do something that, like, shows off, like, hey, there are still good old game, uh, good games in the old ba uh, in the old packs, uh, like retro style, whether it's Super Nintendo or GameCube. Um, or even if it's, like, a PS2 era, because I can actually do PS2 era games now. Uh, am I going to do Wild Arms 3? I'm going to reiterate this for those that may have missed that or wondering what's going on. That one I'm saving for when our, our compatriot of ours comes back. And as such, like, he knows that that's going to be the case. Um, I'm not going to rush him through that. It's just going to be like, when, when he finally does come back, it's like, well, time to do Wild Arms 3 after we finish the game of the time. Uh, as for, uh, I believe next week we are going to be doing more Doom, as I put it, suffering through Doom, because he doesn't understand that you have to swap through all your fucking weapons in Doom. But, and then... You sort of do, depending on ammo restrictions and what you're up against. Some weapons are better for crowd control. Yeah, um, it's just... I've watched a lot of people play 2016 and Eternal, and most of the people that have played it go like, yeah, no, you kind of have to swap through all the weapons. They did reduce the amount of weapons uh, in the game, I think from... Going from 2016 to Eternal? To Eternal. But then they also swapped some of the mods that you get from 16 in Eternal so that there was a lot more synergy slash um difference between the two because like some of them like the sniper rifle in 2016 was useless because at the time because eh, there was another weapon that operated the exact same way and was much better than the sniper scope on the uh, on the uh rifle so most people just stuck with micro missiles. Uh, but that that's Eddie's game. He he'll he's he'll play through that, and he states that uh, once he gets through Eternal, he's going to be we're going to be moving on to Elden Ring, or spend a day or two doing something else. Uh, if it's uh, if we end up early enough. 
Uh, as for any podcasts, nothing so far on the docket. Um, but all of our podcasts are archived and findable on all major platforms. So Google, Apple, Spotify, all of our uh, streams have been archived on our YouTube channel. I try my best to upload from what's been on stream, but sometimes with certain people's connections, it's like I kind of wish some people would upload the recording directly. But some people don't record their streams because why? Uh, as for next Friday, I will fi uh, make sure everything's done and completed. Uh, for those people that are like, hey, you finished a blood strain, uh, Bloodstain, but there was a recent announcement saying, hey, we're going to be finishing up the final, uh, like, extended goals that we promised you ten years ago. Um, as stated, I did defeat Bloodstained. I'm going to leave all of the extra stuff to either potential future streams, or just, hey, why don't you get the game yourself and play it? <laughs> um, Because I think the new stuff that they're adding is Chaos and Versus mode, and I think cos uh, some more cosmetic DLC. Uh, but I'd say that's about it. And but if you liked what you saw, I know this is kind of a garbage thing to put it on, but hopefully you'll like the next game better, whatever it is. Uh, if you want to support us, best way is spread the word. Let other people know. Uh, if you want to pr uh, support us more directly, we do have the sub points here on Twitch or our Patreon. Thanks for joining, and we hope to hear you guys. Uh, hope to see you guys next time, whenever that is. Till now, everybody.